The police service has been put on high alert after at least 12 people were killed within a 72-hour period over the weekend. CNews understands that a high-level meeting on Sunday with Deputy Police Commissioner Mervyn Richardson, Acting Police Commissioner Stephen Williams and Minister of National Security Emmanuel George resulted in a crime plan being launched to tackle the recent spike in homicides. DCP Richardson told CNews he is not at liberty to divulge the crime plan, but he says the police service is capable of handling the troubling situation. We will not change our direction, but we might change the formation uh, uh, where we're doing things. So to that extent, yes, you will see additional officers and law enforcement, that is police, army, sailors, um, air, fo air guard, and, and, and wherever we have support, even members of the Private Security Network Commission. DCP Richardson says the police service is pursuing all leads with regards to the 12 murders over the weekend and says all matters are under active investigation. He says he understands that it's a very stressful time for the officers under his charge. The police service is, is, is in a state of readiness and we are committed to doing all that is necessary within the law to stem the recent state of crime that has beset this country. The executive of the Police Social and Welfare Association met with the acting commissioner and his deputies at the police administration building on Monday. DCP Richardson says they took on board all the suggestions raised by the association and have agreed to work closer with the association in the future. Karen Kozia, Philip, CNews.